Hi, this is Rob from Keyless Entry Systems and today we're going to look at the install of the UL110. I've had a few requests on how hard it is to install so I thought it'd probably be easier just to show you how it's put together. So we'll start with the, um, the kit that will come in the box. So we'll have a fitting template, we'll have the keys, we'll have the front of the lock with a cover for the, um, for the lock, the barrel or the deadbolt, backing plate, and the back of the lock itself. Now today I've already pre-drilled the holes but to do these holes you're going to need a hole saw and a speed ball to do the deadbolt and just a normal drill bit to do the two holes front and back. Okay so first we'll start with the deadbolt so we'll place that into the, um, the hole that we've created with the speed ball. Get our drill, two screws and gently tap them in. Not too tight, just pinch tight. So don't tighten it up fully yet, that's just so we can um, adjust it and then make sure the lock is opening and closing correctly before we pinch everything tight. Now we're going to put the front of the lock on. So we run the shaft through the deadbolt. And drop it down like that. Okay. okay, so now we've got the backing plate. And you'll notice on here that there's just a little uh, instruction there, this side against the wood. Okay, so we'll flip, we'll flip it up over here. Put it through and we'll install. So we're going to put the back on now. So you'll notice you've got one screw here and you've got two screws here. Okay. So make sure it goes obviously through the um, through the shaft and push it down and be mindful of the cable because you don't want to be cutting the cable. So now we've now we've fitted the back of the lock. Now it's probably best to test your deadbolt now to make sure it's working. Okay. The last thing you want to do is put it all together and it's not working correctly. You've got your two, one long screw at the back and your two shorter screws at the front. So try not to over tighten these because it can damage the lock if you bend the shaft. So always just make sure that you keep testing it to make sure it's working and it it feels free, that it's not hard to, to turn. Just pinch tight at this point. So I'm going to stop, test. Beautiful, that feels nice. Nice and firm. So at this point in time, I'm pretty safe to go and just finish off Tightening my deadbolt. Okay, so again, I've just pinch tied everything. I'm just retesting it in, just making sure it feels smooth. I'm going to place the batteries in. the lock activating now. So finally just test and everything. So just check that that's fitting firmly, not, um, not pinched anywhere. Test it by putting the key and the deadlock of the bolt back. And then finally test it using the app. Okay, thanks for watching. Any queries, please don't hesitate to contact us on 1300 873 579. Thank you.
And finally, just check that uh, it's all fitting correctly around the outside. The key is functioning correctly. Dead bolt at the back. And finally, of course, use the app. Thanks for watching the latest video from Keyless Entry System.